everyone and welcome to the Let's Play Sims 3 video that I am making at the moment. So I hope you guys enjoy this video and please comment, subscribe and like. So before I start actually playing the game I just want to do this video to show you the characters that I have and my house and you know stuff like that to introduce you to my game. So, uh, in the next short clip, I will be showing you my characters and it will have their names written underneath so you can get used to the characters that I will be having in my Let's Plays. So, yeah. And here they are. showing you inside my house so before we go inside I'll just show you outside so basically outside we just have some deck chairs and umbrella we have two swimming pools one of them is just a normal swimming pool and then over in this swimming pool we have loads of stones on the outside and we have two diving boards and some bikes are behind that and we have our newspaper that I was probably supposed to pick up and then we just have a tree over here, which is really cute. It's like a magical tree. I really love it. And then we just have a bench for my Sims to just sit and think about stuff if they're depressed or whatever. And then over here, we just have two cars. And now we will go inside my house. So my house is two floors together. So I have two floors and that is just how high my house is um so inside my house in the first room you go into we just have a red sofa which i really like we have this random bunny picture i don't know what it is it looks like a bunny it probably is a bunny and i just picked it up thinking that looks unique and different i'm getting that and i did get it and it looks pretty cool and then we just have a little table over here with a phone on so my sims can like phone people if they want to and yeah. And then we just have some lights because my sims don't can't see in the dark unfortunately so yeah those lights come in useful hands. And then the next room you go into we have the living room which is really nice and this is probably my favourite room. And my favourite item in the room is probably this rug. I don't know why, I just love it so much and I really like it. So we just have a TV up above this little drawer thing where I pretend my sims keep their DVDs and, you know, video games in. And we just have, obviously, a video game console underneath. And then we just have three sofas. One's a three-seater and the other two are two-seaters. And then we just have this really awesome chandelier. I'm not sure if you can see it because it's slightly faint. But, you know, I think you can see it better now. But, you know, I really like that. And then we just have these two lights beside the three-seater sofa. Just because I thought it should add a little light into the room in case the chandelier isn't enough. And then we go into the kitchen. So my kitchen, I'm not that impressed with. But, you know... I don't mind that much because I can always do it up later on and I probably will in my future videos. So we just have a black fridge and then we just have some counters and you know the usual stuff you'd have in the kitchen. And I do know my fridge is an absolute stink bomb because I can see there's some green stink coming out of it at the moment. You know classy that's just normal in my sim world. And then next to that, we just have a bar area. I really like it. This is also one of my favourite rooms. And it's really good for music videos and things like that. And I just really like it because, as you might know, if you play the normal Sims, then there's not that many good bars around and about. So I just thought, why not just have my own bar? It's just easier for us all. And then over here, we just have a spiral staircase going upstairs. And outside, I forgot to say this, we just have a little 
boom box kind of thing that's just randomly there for music videos or in case my sims want to dance outside you know that's normal and then once you go upstairs there's this really awesome wallpaper on the landing I'm so in love with that I just did that today and I really like it and then we just have a little toilet over here that everyone can use we do have two toilets in this house and I'm probably going to make a third because there is five of my sims all together so you know quite a lot of toilets would be useful and I'm not that keen on this toilet as it's really dark so I haven't actually put any lights in but um you know it's not that good because I haven't done it up really I just put some random toilet stuff in there I will do it up because I like my toilets to look nice random fact there and then over here we just have Katie's room and she just shares this with herself because she hasn't got anyone yet but we will eventually find a boyfriend or girl f no not yeah boyfriend for her she's not gonna be um getting a girlfriend she will get a boyfriend and then over here we just have a shower area for her and her toilet and her little mirror where she can check herself out see how she's looking before she goes out to work or if she's going out for a party or something like that and then she's just got an easel over here where she's just started drawing and she isn't that good at drawing at the moment so we will improve on that skill in future videos and then she just has a little picture above her bed and I really like her bed, it's really unique. And then we just have a little desk area where she, if she was a little school child, then she could do her homework. But as she likes to browse the web, web a lot, then yeah, that's what she does there. And then we just have the desk there so that the computer can sit on there and look neat. And then we just have this really awesome mirror, if I turn around. You can see that. I really love this mirror. It is so cool. I love it. And then, as you can see in the mirror's mirror, there is a dresser over here. This dresser was pretty expensive, but it was definitely worth it because it looks really, really awesome. And then on the landing, because I haven't exactly finished um, Brad's and Chanel's room yet, they're just sleeping on the landing for the moment and eventually I will get a third floor when I have enough money and I will build them a really nice bedroom and I'll make their bedroom big as everyone else's bedroom is really big. And then over here in this room we just have, what's their names, um, Peter and Laurel's room. Their room is really nice and I, this is probably my favourite room most likely even though i said the living room was my favorite room i think but this room is probably my second favorite fa my second favorite room so we just have a little bed here and then we just got the normal stuff we have in the bedroom we have some lighting um i think we also have a chandelier i'm not sure i don't know and we have a sofa and we have this really awesome TV. I thought we wouldn't get the other TV that I have in my living room because that is a really expensive TV. So I thought we'd just get this TV. And then we just have their little getting ready areas, you know, a little dresser, which is really awesome. So this is Peter's dresser, as you can see. He's got some magazines and a mirror and some pencil pot stuff. And then over here we have um, Laurel's little dressing area which she just has some perfume, some makeup and she has a little chair which she can sit on because she will obviously take longer probably because she likes to be perfect at getting ready and look really nice in the day so yeah that's why she has a chair because otherwise she'd probably get tired just standing there doing her hair or her makeup or whatever and then we just have this Oh, jeez. Sorry about that. Sometimes that is just really annoying where you're trying to get through to a room, you end up in another room, if you know what I mean. But over here, we just have a really nice balcony for them. They have a sliding door going out to it, and they can just look down at the people that may be in the pool, or if there's no one in the pool, they can just look down at the pool. And then they can just look out at the beach. Yeah, I love living near the beach. That's why I chose this house. So I hope you guys enjoyed this short, well it wasn't that short actually, but this video. And please comment, subscribe and like. So yeah, bye.